Aloha folks. I hope you're having a great week. Hey, when I was a kid, I would fall down sometimes, get a scrape or a scratch. And one of the very first things that I would want to do is run home and ask my mom for a Band-Aid. I uh, liked wearing Band-Aids as a kid. I, I don't know if you can relate to that. But a Band-Aid, it can keep the dirt out. It can maybe keep the scratch or the scrape from getting worse but it doesn't do a very good job of healing. In fact, the best Band-Aid in the world won't heal you. I remember what my mom would do is she would pull out some alcohol or peroxide. Man, that's the last thing I wanted to see. And she would clean that wound out with that alcohol or peroxide and it would sting, it would hurt. But you know, that's exactly what needed to be done. It needed to be cleaned out. It needed to be uh, washed so that it could heal properly. You know, we get scrapes and scratches inside of us as well. And many times they're caused by our poor decisions, our sinful decisions. And mm, a lot of times we try to put band-aids on those things. We try to just cover them up. That never heals those situations. What we need is some spiritual alcohol, some spiritual peroxide. In scripture, what that is, is confession. Listen to Proverbs 28:13. It says, people who conceal their sins will not prosper, but if they confess and turn from them, they'll receive mercy. See, when we go to God and we confess our sins, it's sometimes painful, it sometimes hurts. That's the way that we heal. That's the way he can make us whole again. Let's be people that go before him and confess our sin and not try to cover them up. Hey, I wanted to remind you about Fall Fest. It's only a couple of weeks away, Friday, November 20th. Many of you have signed up and that's great. We've got a, a lot of tickets left though that we need to give out. And each one of those tickets stands for a meal. That's the way that folks will get their meals. They'll bring their ticket here as they drive in and uh, we'll be able to give them a meal. So if you have more folks that you would like to invite, get some tickets this Sunday. Let's get those things out and bless as many people we can on Friday, November 20th. And then folks, we need to be praying. Uh, we have just come through a very contentious election. And even as I'm sitting here uh, videotaping this for you today, we don't know who's won, but we need to pray. Our country really needs to turn back to God. So let's pray. Hey, let me remind you as we close out our time together, Romans 12, 12, rejoice in our confident hope. Be patient in trouble and keep on praying. Hey, I hope you have a great rest of the week and that I get a chance to see you this Sunday as we continue in our series, Fear Less.